Thursday morning as we turn our attention to the other side of the desk. Yeah, we're looking ahead to the forecast. I uh, did see some storms last night, but uh, kind of wrapping up with the rain this morning will be dry this afternoon. It looks like that's going to be a nice stretch or start of a stretch of uh, dry weather that will last through the weekend and could almost last through the 4th of July. It does look like at least this morning that we'll have a chance for some rain on the 4th. That's actually our next chance for rain after we get this uh, light rain out of here first thing this morning. 67 now, it's mostly cloudy. We are expecting it to be fairly cloudy weather uh, all the way through at least about 1 or 2 o'clock. We'll start to see some breaks in the clouds there. Winds will be out of the west 7 miles an hour this morning. We have our barometer still fairly low as we're starting off. Here's a look at those temperatures. 67 in the Butler area, containing 66. Denora 68 degrees and Washington 68. Champion also coming in at about 66 degrees and we're expecting a high today right at about 80 degrees cloudy for most of the day. Once again, those winds out of the west at 5 to 10 miles an hour. Very late today. We will start to see them a little bit more out of the northwest. So here's how I think our day is going to break down. The clouds this morning is going to hamper really our that's warming up. We'll still be at around 70 degrees at noon, but 74 at 2. 4 o'clock temperature coming in 78 and a 6 o'clock temperature right at 79 degrees. Highs near 90 starting tomorrow and a little relief from the heat with lows near 70 degrees. We do have some concerns there. This is going to be the hottest weather, some of the hottest weather we've seen in quite some time here in western Pennsylvania. So with that will come the really the threat of uh, heat exhaustion, especially for those that don't have AC in their homes and those that are working outside for long stretches of time. The good news at this point, though, so most of this is going to occur over the weekend and into a holiday. So a lot of folks will have it off and hopefully can take it easy as this uh, warm weather continues to move by. Best chance for rain today is going to be right along I-80, and that's where we're seeing some rain showers this morning. This is basically just a couple of sprinkles. It's not much at all, and it's going to be continuing to push off to the east. Dry conditions just off to the uh, west of that, and that high pressure will roll in. That'll dry us out for the next few days. Also, when you get to this time of the year and you see high pressure coming in, it also likely means you're going to be looking at some really warm weather that's going to be in place. That's going to be the case. We'll start you off on Saturday. Feels like temperature. This isn't the actual temperature. Feels like temperature mid 90s for Saturday overnight. Temperatures right at 70 degrees and then we turn even hotter right around 100 degrees for our feels like temperatures on Sunday. And then look at what happens on Monday. Temperatures starting off in the 70s. High temperatures, though, right around 100 degrees at times for the afternoon. And we stay just as hot as we're heading into the 4th of July. There's your seven day outlook. 80, your high today. 89, your forecast high on Friday. And 92, the forecast high on Saturday. 93 for highs both Sunday and Monday in the forecast.